<laughs> well, this time I'm going to be speaking for our community benevolence outreaches, which missions and outreaches, I just, I just love going to, um, to work in both of those areas. I love all the areas, but anyway. Uh, but I'm going to talk to you about Belpre Area Ministries, also known as BAM, as you'll see in your bulletin sometimes, which is located here in Belpre. And we also are um, partners and supporters of Old Man Rivers in Parkersburg, reaching both sides of the river. Belpre Area Ministry is an organization that opened its doors in 1995. The dedicated volunteer staff last year put in over 8,800 hours. They served enough food for over 20,000 meals and serving over 500 households, providing food, helping them with utilities, educational um, support, and also with um, rent and different things that they, they are available when you have shut-off notices and things that you can tell I really work at BAM a lot because I know everything. But uh, when they have a lot of different things that happens in your life, they have a lot of services. The services are, they also have the thrift store. I read past myself. I was talking beyond me. Isn't that awful? And they have, but anyway, the thrift store that they have has very low prices um, that will, helps the community and all the proceeds from the thrift store go to helping the people back into the BAM structure that they have. We as the Celebration Center have the opportunity to have hands-on help at BAM about every three months. I organize teams that go there to work in the thrift shop, the food pantry, and in the office. They meet in the office where you meet and take care of the needs of the people one-on-one. -on -one. And then we have another group that we just call them sorters. We just haven't figured out a better word for that, have we, girls? And um, But anyway, they're the ones who, when the donations come into the store, like the clothing or, or shoes or whatever comes, somebody has to sort them. Somebody has to decide that this is this goes out or this goes to the Salvation Army because a lot of different things that they don't use um, because, you know, the store does get well stocked, but we're able to send it to some of the local nursing homes and different places that help a lot of organizations. But anyway, here at the Celebration Center, again, I have to thank all of the crew of people that come and help. Um, I've just really been so blessed because <coughs> the need is there, and as always, you guys always are supporting and helping to meet those needs. But another commercial, anybody would like to be involved, we're always welcome and new people and just come and we'll find something that you can you can do there you can watch in the church bulletins and when it says that it's our term to serve at Belpre area ministries that's what that means we're going to go up and be working old man rivers mission of parkersburg the mission is celebrating its 21st year of service this year the mission serves meal every Saturday and every Sunday, and they actually <coughs> serve over 300 to 340 meals every weekend out of the trucks. Some of you may have seen them driven around town, but they delivered about 190 meals to people also who are homebound, handed out between 20 and to um, 60 meals underneath the bridge, which they do behind the Blennerhassett Museum. Last year, the, the mission served over 33,000 meals. The back-to-school programs that they do for children served over 1,100 backpacks with school supplies and clothes. The mission also provides a program called Pick a Package for Your Child, where the parents are able to come and shop for their children. They have a food pantry that averages about 180 families a month. Because of the growing need, they've started offering some assistance also for utility bills. They are helping people with eye exams and glasses. The mission also provides assistance for prescription for medications, a clothing pantry where they have coats, gloves, hats, and blankets, and they're available all year during the winter months. If you'd like more information to volunteer over there or to be a part, you can see me as well, and we can help you to be able to be hook up and to be able to either go serve food or probably help them in their pantries and different things as well. Matthew 25, 35 through 40 says, for I was hungry and you gave me something to eat. I was thirsty and you gave me something to drink. I was a stranger and you invited me in. I needed clothes and you clothed me. I was sick and you looked after me and you looked after me. I was in prison and you came to visit me. Then the righteous will answer him, Lord, when did we see you hungry and feed you or thirsty and give you something to drink? When did we see you a stranger and invite you in or some or sometime needing clothing, did we clothe you? When did we see you sick or in prison and go visit you? The king will reply, Truly I tell you, whatever you did for one of the least of these brothers and sisters of mine, you have done for me. Together we are making a difference and showing the love of God in our communities and in our generations to come. Thank you. <laughs> 